got it resonating, the inputs resonating with the coils. Just because yesterday I got a tiny screwdriver, <laughs> which you need for this bloom bucking coil there to set the voltage. And I was playing with it and I realised, hang on a minute, it's making noises. When I move the magnet over the top, it's affecting the magnetic field of the coils, which seems to be, which is changing the tone. So that lets me know there's a, there's a connection between the coils and the, the back converter. And I'm just watching the voltage. When the voltage goes up, the tone changes. So my thought is, is that as the voltage increases, I, you'd actually have to tune it, keep tuning the input voltage to match the, uh, because there's nothing on the, on the out. The out is just rectified straight from the coil, straight into the battery. There's no cap dump, nothing like that just relying on the very high frequency to do its work. There is a capacitor across the uh, the output, but otherwise, keep watching them numbers and try and figure out which way to tune this and what's the best tone to keep it at. Let me know what you think. What a mess. Good evening, good afternoon, good morning. I'm using the wife's phone to make this video because obviously my phone is occupied. Three six takes a long time, so I'm still not 100% convinced. Sitting here for an hour, two hours, three hours. That battery went down to 12.01, but I don't like this meter don't like these meters. I need a way to really confirm it so I don't want to leave it on though when I go out today. So it's difficult because you end up just sitting here for hours <laughs> staring at numbers listening to tones. This um, the app, what's the app called? Let me find it. It's called Spectroid. And it's helping me tune my resonance. Like super fine tuning. <laughs> like you wouldn't believe how fine this has to be. There you go. I could just turn it down, not even like. Now you can't even breathe when you're doing it. <laughs> I have to hold my breath when I'm tuning it. Let me know what you think. It's a buck converter going into the pancake coil TPU circuit that I showed previously being rectified on the output. Got a 33,000 UF cap, not dumping it or anything, just the cap just hopefully stabilizes the the resonance a little bit. Going straight to the battery. Battery's going back into the uh, back converter. 
power in it. I'll keep watching it. I won't. I think I'm going out today. I'm gonna go try them. What is it called? The the Maglev train. But um, later on, I'll get my super caps hooked up in twelve volt series or however you hook them up, and I'll see if I can get it a bit of result from that. I don't have my oscilloscope here. And I'm not going to buy a new one. But it's interesting. Beautiful sunny day today. Enjoy it. <laughs>